Hey everyone, it's your buddy Crypto Profit back with another video. And today we're going to be taking a quick look at Polygon Matic. So we are at that dollar fifty-seven right now, a 0.24% decrease. Market cap right below that 10 billion. Volume in the last 24 hours being a little bit above that 1.2 billion. And we're seeing, you know, really substantial growth in the last month. If we take a look at the last month, even during these massive market dips and ma market crashes, we're seeing a 93.19% increase. And that kind of brings me to my first article of the day that we're really going to be taking a look at. And that's the Polygon matic token ended up with may being 120 percent despite bitcoin's price crash so with all of the price crashes that we saw all of the crypto market dips and crashes uh you know polygon still up 120 percent in may is pretty substantial obviously uh you know polygon holders are definitely going to be very very happy about that and we're seeing that uh you know there's still a lot of potential left so the surging use of really polygon's network ethereum layer 2 scaling solution allowed that platforms token Matic to largely escape the fate of other cryptocurrencies in May brought down by the crash of Bitcoin and other cryptos. So we do see this as a very, very big story. I think, you know, a lot of us don't really realize how good Polygon actually did throughout the month with all of these dips. We also saw it go all the way down to about 87 cents. And now we're still sitting at that dollar fifty seven. So a great increase in recovery from that, you know, that that crash or that dip itself. So I do want to talk about price predictions for June, July and 2021. If you guys want to stick around for that, that'll be at the end of the video. I also wanted to give you guys a kind of a brief explanation of Polygon before we jump into more like I said, news and information of the day. So the first thing I'll say is Polygon was formerly called Matic Network. Polygon Matic is an Ethereum token that powers the Polygon Network, a scaling solution for Ethereum. Polygon aims to provide faster and cheaper transactions on Ethereum using Layer 2 sidechains, which are blockchains that run alongside the Ethereum main chain. Users can deposit Ethereum tokens to a Polygon smart contract, interact with them within Polygon, and then later withdraw them back to the Ethereum main chain. The Matic token is used to pay transaction fees and participate in proof of stake consensus. So this is a big deal, obviously seeing, you know, Polygon as a really necessity to the Ethereum network, definitely a utility token that provides exactly what it needs to provide for Ethereum. So uh, we're going to deep dive into some of the different tweets and really partnerships and integrations as well as, like I said, uh, why Polygon is so uh, looking so bullish. So the first tweet is going to be talking about excited to announce that Dino X project is building on Polygon. With Polygon, Dino X can utilize decentralized databases, decentralized identification frameworks, and other tools for seamless gaming experiences. So Dino X project is a very, very small project with 324 followers, but it's definitely something to look into as Polygon recently hasn't had as much, you know, integrations and partnerships that it, uh, you know, has had in the past days. Assuming that is because obviously it is the weekend, Saturday, Sunday, it usually slows down a little bit. So we'll continue to keep you guys up to date this, uh, you know, coming week when we get some hopefully some big projects and uh, announcements on integrations and partnerships. Seeing the next one, we see now you can use permissionless flash loans on Polygon with Unilend Finance. This will help with on chain liquidity improvement, arbitrage opportunities, and other benefits for users on Polygon. So this is obviously a big deal. Unilend Finance has about 32.9K followers, so they are a little bit larger of a project so this is definitely something uh you know lo worth looking into jumping into the next one this is going to be the biggest partnership the 91k followers dodo dex uh, or breeder dodo it talks about an on-chain liquidity provider is now live on polygon dodo's dex platform comes with the following offerings mining crowd pulling ido pools pmm and many more so this is definitely like i said one of the bigger projects or partnerships that uh, really has been integrated with polygon now and i think you know we're going to continue to see these large large projects come in to handy uh you know down the line when we're looking for reasons to continue to invest in polygon a lot of investors like the idea of these large projects uh you know really already taking advantage of polygon in the scaling solution that it is uh jumping into our next tweet though it's going to talk about ok coin integrates with polygon to reduce uh, reduce sorry users ethereum gas fees so this is a big deal as well this was actually june 3rd but i did want to re-mention this because you know this is just showing that a lot of people and a lot of i guess a lot of projects not really people a lot of projects are starting to utilize polygon because of the idea of you know those really trying to reduce users ethereum gas fees and i think that's one thing that you know polygon does great we continue to see the scaling solution operate exactly how it's supposed to and that's uh, exactly what you want to see we're not going to talk too much about this because like i said we mentioned this in our previous video but i did want to re kind of re-mention this because uh, it's a big deal and i think we are going to continue to see projects really want to utilize that polygon ecosystem so next we have here's what is next for ethereum and polygon according to crypto analytics firm sentiment so if we go down a little bit or i guess sentiment is it sentiment yeah sentiment so if we go down a little bit we can actually see crypto analytics 
firm Santiment is weighing in on what could be in store for Ethereum ETH in Red Hot Polygon Matic. Santiment is revealing the, uh, or I guess that Ethereum's address activity is growing, that the quantity of active deposits has died down since the panic sell-off of late May. So jumping down a little bit farther, it talks more about Matic specifically. So if we go down to here, it talks about overall Matic's MRV is a problem. It's going to remain a problem for a while. No matter what happens, farther correction is needed until we move into the undervalued territory. And I'd agree with that. We are at a pretty good price point. I do think we have a little bit more of a drop to take place before we see undervalued. But I still think we are, you know, definitely where we belong at the very, very least. And I think we actually, uh, you know, could see some great substantial increases in the months of, uh, you know, June, July and 2021 altogether. Uh, but we also see down here, the firm is still bullish on Matic and offers up three statistics that traders should keep an eye on when assessing the blockchain scalability platform. Overall, there are more bullish signs and bearish at the moment, and here are the things to watch. So active addresses, whale transactions count, and obviously whales behavior. Uh, you can always, you know, keep an eye on the holders distribution itself. And, you know, this is definitely something that a lot of, you know, very successful traders do is they understand whale transactions. They understand whale behaviors and they understand how to really benefit from them. So uh, if you want to get really good at trading, figure out how to really benefit from whale transactions and whale behaviors. Uh, jumping into the Polygon um, price chart just one more time here because we are going to be talking about price predictions for June, July, and 2021. As we're down about 0.44% in the last 24 hours, Polygon is still a, you know, a coin that we've talked about a lot on the channel because it has such really substantial, uh, you know, opportunities ahead. I mean, you know, so many people want to utilize the idea of this layer two solution that, uh, really does make Ethereum so much, I guess, you know, more usable and, uh, so much better in a, in, in a wide sense of ways. So let's talk about June. The first month of June, I do think we are going to continue on this really uptrend um, for the most part. Obviously, you know, we're down 0.44% uh, and then the last week we're also down about 7.46%. But I do think we're going to start on a slow but steady sideways slash uptrend for the month of June. I do think we're going to be ending around $1.75 to $2.00. Uh, you know, that's going to be a very, very conservative price prediction. And I think a lot of people are hoping to hear more. But do remember, guys, we're in that accumulation, FUD, or manipulation stage. So not much is going to happen in the month of June, in my opinion. I think by the end of July, we could get lucky enough to break out. And I think a lot of altcoins specifically could, you know, break out of this, uh, you know, maybe really accumulation stage, I should say. But, you know, this accumulation stage is only going to last for so long. So by the end of July, I think we could easily see Polygon pushing closer and closer to about a 225 to 275 price point. Uh, realistically, definitely has a shot at that $3 as well, to be honest, because if we break out, I do expect a fast, rapid breakout and Polygon could push very, very quickly. But, you know, realistically, 250 to 275 is where I'm going to stick it just because I do want to kind of pin it up between that 250 and $3 mark at the very least. So Polygon, by the end of July, 250 to 275, I think we are going to blast off and we're going to see, you know, some great prices for Polygon users. We see that 268 is our, you know, previous all-time high. So if we do get to that 275, we will have a new all-time high recorded for Polygon. Jumping into really the end of the bull market or the end of the year, I do think Polygon will continue on this really price increase, this price uh, rise. And I think, you know, the month of uh, May specifically kind of shows what Polygon is doing correct. Uh, you know, it's continuing to have a great amount of investors taking place and jumping in. So by the end of the year, I do think, you know, Polygon could easily reach right around 7 to $12 by the end of the year and the end of the bull market at the very least. So that's going to be my price predictions. Let me know in the comments if you guys agree or disagree with my price predictions as well as, you know, subscribe to the channel, turn notifications on and like the video to stay up to date with Polygon as well as so many other altcoins every single day. We try to keep you guys as up to date as possible as we get closer and closer to 100K subscribers. I cannot thank you guys enough. Thank you guys again. I'll see you all in the next one.